well, let's talk hair. How excited yes. are you for your new beauty line for hair now? Well, I am so excited. I thought me and my sisters were such beauty junkies and we love makeup and hair and all that kind of stuff. And we work with the best of the best hairstylists. And so I think we have a lot of know-how as to what we like. And we always have, like, if you look under my sink, I have so many different brands and products. So to have all of our favorite things and put them into one line at a really great price. Wow. I just think it's awesome. And the smell is awesome. Yeah, I, I smell it. I know, I've like been it. smelling it like crazy. <laughs> it's um, rose smell, so it's really awesome. So I love the blonde hair. Thank you. So is, is do you guys inspire each other to go back and forth? I always know there's like little friendly competition in the oh, house. Yeah, for sure. So was Kim saying she did the blonde better, or do you feel you did the blonde better? Um. I don't think we say who did it better, but I definitely know in our heads we're like probably thinking something. Kim's was really intense and very fashiony, which I thought yeah. was great for her. I don't think I could ever go that platinum with no root, so Kim could have that. She could win that blue ribbon. I'm, I'm glad she's that. she's having fun with it because yeah. she's so about fashion, and that look was stunning for Fashion Week. Oh yeah, for but sure. I do love you, blonde. Thank you. I am really fair, so I think I look better lighter. I was born lighter, more of like a dirty blonde. And um, I've always tried to dye my hair dark to look more like my sisters. And I think when I got older, I'm just like, oh, screw it, who cares? I am who I am and embrace it. I have three sisters, so I understand the back and forth of inspiring each other. Like, I love how you now see Kylie. And it seems like she oh. went from a Jenner to like full Kardashian no, sister, she which is I love. like a sex goddess, or <laughs> I don't know if that's appropriate to say, but she's just so sexy and doesn't even try. Like she really, she'll just come over and like, little shorts and like a baggy t-shirt. I'm like, I do not look like that if I wore that. I would look like an Oompa Loompa, but she is so cute. She understands her appeal. Yeah, she does. And yeah, she gets, we get inspired by each other for sure. Definitely, and I think it motivates all of us. Of course. Sometimes we have to give Courtney a pep talk because we're like, she has three kids and is so busy with like, look, Court. Come on, you gotta give us a little more effort. So she's trying. <laughs> well, it was really sweet. I saw today that she actually posted a picture of yes, rain. Yes, she did and I. Uh, she asked Kim and I, like she sent us three pictures, which one do we like? Oh. And so we all picked and we all agreed on that one. I was happy she posted a picture. It was really sweet, mm -hmm. a sweet moment. What will you guys be doing for Easter? We were on a whole group chat just talking about it. Um, Kendall actually brought it up. And so I think we're gonna go to Kim's house and we're gonna do, we already dyed some eggs, but that day we'll dye some more eggs. We have a big Easter egg hunt. Oh, nice. But I have to go over after this and help with the, like put the Easter eggs oh. together. Cause we like to do it ourselves. Right. Do you like my dad done? He used to get a bunch of change and like drop it in the grass and we'd all like go no, search. No, not even in eggs? <laughs> no. My dad was like super cheap. He'd be like, here's some change and we'd all like search in the grass. I would love to do that. They're used to, my mom used to put like a 50 or a 20 in one uh. egg and we would go crazy and we would shake them all and leave them if they made noise because we were such little greedy kids. So I don't know if we're going to, they're too young, I think, to understand. What that a couple is. dollars in there. Courtney and I will fight over it. We'll be like, give me the money. We'll fight over it. But it's fun. Now, I know on this upcoming episode of mm -hmm. Keeping Up with the Kardashians, you and your mom talk about, you know, sitting down with Rob and yeah. really talking with him. Mm -hmm. And how is he doing? You know, Rob, I think, is in a stuck place in his life, but he has ups and downs like we mm -hmm. all do. And right now he's doing a little better but i want to see him do consistently better for mm -hmm. more than like a week or so well so, you're such a good cheerleader is he still uh, living with you yeah he okay, lives with good. me he's my baby i can't have him not live with me mm -hmm. but i like it I, I think if he's alone it might put someone like in a darker space if you know i need a cheerleader sometimes too and someone right. to push me to go work out or do whatever so i want to be the same for him well, i think that's a great thing about having a big family is you know with everything that's kind of going on right now even mm -hmm. with rob and with bruce it's like you guys are all there for each other mm -hmm. how has that been as a family just everything that you guys are dealing with right now i think like our blessing i mean yeah all brothers and sisters you bicker and fight but i would not have my life any other way with um we're all in this together and we mm -hmm. all get to kind of have like therapy together like going back and forth and we each go to a different sibling for a different issue or problem or what we want to vent to we connect with someone else differently right. and I don't think I could handle it without them like I am so blessed that I do have all of them for any life struggle even when my father passed away I could not imagine if I was an only child and right. went through that so it's a blessing to have all of us crazy kids together <laughs> it really is no I get it like I said I'm from big family okay final question what uh, easy tip would you give girls off for hair products and stuff like that like is there like a certain you get out of bed and don't want to wash your hair or is there I got to be somewhere in 20 minutes well I am a huge dry shampoo person because I don't like to wash my hair every day because a blowout takes time and it's 
annoying. So I'm a big dry <laughs> shampoo person. And then normally the third day, I use like our black seed oil and I'll slick it into a pony. Mm. So I do. I try to wear Make my Make the grease work for no, you. Yes, exactly. <laughs> I'm trying to use it as long as I can.